Hello everybody and welcome to another update. I'm setting some time aside right now to just put out a few updates because a lot of you have been asking, so it's time to do an update on the Bullet and Queen. And the Bullet and Queen is of course hiding right down here. I made a short a few weeks ago when the Bullet and Queen got its first cocoon and um, yeah, they now have two cocoons right here and three tiny larvae. Not tiny, they're actually massive. Uh, she also had a few eggs, but the eggs seems to have been eaten uh, most likely because I waited a little bit too long with feeding. I try to feed them every other or twice a week um, and it worked great for the first feed, but um, yeah, the, this round or this time around the eggs have been eaten sadly, but we still have three larvae on the way. One big one, two smaller ones and two cocoons. Now what is crazy to think about is the size difference between these two cocoons. That's a massive size difference and it's yeah, it's really weird. You would think they would be close to the same size, but uh, but no. This is, of course, the Bullet and Queen, the Parapanera Clavata from Ann and Co. There'll be a discount code down in the description, so be sure to check that out. And uh, yeah, you can really see her beautiful red color right here. She is, first of all, she's a beast, and um, she is also extremely active, like you can see right here. Wow. Yeah, that looks very... Oh, she's a pretty one. Oh, she's a pretty one. Um, yeah, I, I mean, I don't, I don't know what to say. She is one of my favorite ants at the moment, just because she's so alive, so active, and look at her reddish colors. She's such a beautiful queen. Now, I did have have her on my hand a few weeks ago, back when we did the crazy stream, and a lot of people were like, "Oh no, you stressed her crazy much." But the day after the stream, she was actually back laying eggs. So she laid eggs immediately after me actually having her on my hand. So, yeah, if you haven't watched that stream, oh, you've missed something. But yeah. Not too much to say. I keep feeding her. Uh, I also went with the blue sugar snaps. And the way I feed her is just pre-killed food. I feed all of my ants pre-killed. And you can just see I just... I don't know where all of these flies are coming from. Super annoying at the moment. But yeah, I just chop up a lot of small food pieces. This is from the feed from yesterday. And she just takes whatever she wants to take. Apparently, not a lot has been taken this time around. But as long as there's three larvae and they're not disappearing, I'm a happy man. So... um Let's 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 hope they stay. Um, I don't know how long these have been cocoons for, uh, as long as I put out the video on at this, the, the last short here on the channel. So it's been quite a few weeks since I put out that short, and that's of course when she uh, she got the first cocoon. I mean, I I don't know what to say about it. She's just such a beautiful ant. I love her red color. And yeah, this is the Parapanera clavata from Ant & Co. living in this all Wakushi setup. This is the Mimesia set that you can find on wakushi.com. Just search Mimesia set and you'll be able to find this right here. Works great for different larger ants. I've also seen people keep singularis in here. And um, yeah, for my sake, they're just doing wonderful. If we look here a little bit at the cocoa fiber or debris, whatever this is, it's a little bit too moist. So... I know to perhaps skip a hydration week next week. And that's actually one of the issues I have with these. They're very easy to overhydrate. I fill up this, not easy, but I fill up this chamber once a week. And sometimes that's too much. Sometimes you have to wait two weeks in between. Once a week, I top this up and look how wet this is. Unbelievable how good this is at keeping your humidity up. So that's just amazing if you have going on a longer vacation or whatever. Uh, but yeah, super beautiful queen super beautiful brood levels and with that all being said don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll catch you all in the next video be sure to also check out Bakushi and and code discount codes for both of them down in the description all right catch you all in another video bye